This is already the last day of the 15th edition of the World Policy Conference. What were the highlights of this edition for you? I think that uh, the world this year is uh, more complicated than uh, that it ever was in the, in the last uh, 15 year, uh, years. The, the first edition actually was at the very moment of the Lehman Brothers uh, crisis. Uh, since then, uh, everything has been in trouble for some reason or, or, or another. And this year is particularly complicated. I think that uh, this uh, edition has been a great success because uh, we had good people on most of the subjects who could speak in a realistic way. That is, uh, we put, uh, I think, uh, ideology uh, aside and we try to understand uh, what the big issues are, what the outcomes uh, can be. And also we did that, I think, uh, in uh, spirit, in the spirit of the WPC, which is to uh, develop a mutual understanding. And uh, even though we want to be realistic, we want also to bring solutions, to bring uh, ideas, to, to bring some hope. And in the spirit of, of, of governance, that is, uh, even though the world is more and more divided, fragmentation everywhere and so forth and so on, there is a deep uh, shared understanding that uh, cooperation, that is organized uh, governance, is absolutely necessary, necessary for the survival of the world. So this is what I, I take essentially. We, we had the a minister of, of Ukraine yesterday. We had a, lo a lot of local ministers also here from, from the region. What would be the the, the one topic that you have in mind. We had uh, talked a lot about climate change also, this edition. There was a new new theme that was uh, the split it up in this, uh, during this conference. Um, Geopolitics are already there for a lo lot of, but it was very different this year. It was very different, but you know, just to take uh, issues such as technological uh, uh, issues, uh, such as uh, food uh, uh, security, uh, these kind of topics uh, are, are, are very interesting because they force everybody to think positively. Uh, in terms of solutions? In terms of solutions. You know. And uh, it's uh, whether you are an intellectual or a business uh, person or a politician, uh, everybody can understand that uh, food security is something that has to be managed and uh, it combines uh, objective necessity with a certain idealism, a certain, uh, uh, certain humanistic uh, approach to, to, to the world. So you have, to be, you have to be positive. Talking about the climate change, it's the same because uh, 2022, in my judgment, is very important because this is perhaps the first year that everyone in the world is feeling concretely what it means. Yeah. You know, all of us, you, me, uh, uh, our friends around us, uh, all of us understand that something is really changing. And we could also see the catastrophes in uh, Pakistan, for instance. The fruits. So we have to do something. And uh, so uh, there is a, a, a sense of uh, positive action, uh, if I can say so, which is emerging from this kind of discussions among people of, of goodwill, you know, people who do not want to show that they are the best, the brightest, and so forth and so on, but they understand in a way that they are all in the same boat and that we have to um, organize ourselves to, to survive. Would you dare to say what the topics will be for the next edition? Or is the world changing so fast right now and we, COVID, we hadn't seen it coming? Uh, uh, Energy the, prices, the, Ukraine. The, the, the world is uh, changing fast, but you, 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 you have invariance. Peace and war, uh, it's something that has always existed. Uh, of course, the Ukraine war is uh, very important. It, it is likely to, to, to continue in the next few months. So 
uh, next year. Uh, I think that this uh, subject will be also on, on, on the front page, so to, so to speak. But uh, with major economic I issues, we spoke a lot about economic development, financial, uh, uh, fi uh, financial governance and these things. We spoke about the these things in a positive, uh, uh, absolutely. And, and these topics will be still there with, with, with us. So you have a s number of topics that, uh, uh, that, that are here to stay. Uh, will we have a major uh, event in between uh, that would uh, force us to, to, to see uh, things in a slightly uh, different way. Uh, it, it is possible. I, I, I think we are, uh, for the next few years, we are likely to have uh, surprises, perhaps uh, uh, at least one uh, every year. By the way, we had also very interesting sessions on um, uh, health, uh, global health, and uh, yeah. uh, health, uh, global health g governance. Uh, now we all understand that uh, COVID-19 is not finished, is not over, and perhaps will never finish. Mm. The, uh, but we now have a full understanding that uh, other pandemics are very likely. And uh, somebody said this morning, they are unpredictable, but they will happen. Yeah. Therefore, we have to organize ourselves now to uh, be able to react very quickly. Uh, when uh, something I is happening. But things will happen in the next few months, in the next few years. The, uh, the aim of the WPC is to discuss uh, these, subject, these uh, subjects uh, objectively enough to uh, contribute uh, to organize proper uh, reactions uh, to all these uh, unforeseeable things that can happen. See you next year then, with different topics. And with the and same, at and the same time. And we have to both different stay and the same. On, pe on speaking terms in, in the meanwhile, I will say that's also the... Di Absolutely. Thank you so much. Merci. Thank you. Merci.